told you kids not to play in this driveway? Now don't let me catch you here again. Aren't they cute, Papa? I can't wait to get these over to Ella's and see her baby. Do you think Ed will mind if they come and live with us for a while until Joe gets a job? After all, he's your brother. Oh, I don't know. You know, the last time Joe was here, we borrowed Edgar's golf clubs and pawned them. Cost Edgar $35 to get them back, and Joe never has paid him. Well, if Ed wasn't so close, he'd have loaned Joe the money when he asked him for it. I don't blame Joe for not paying him. I wouldn't... Oh, oh Edgar! Uh, we were just talking about you. Oh, hello, darling. Edgar, dear, would you mind if we had a visitor? Joe and Elle, I suppose. Yes, and, uh, and somebody else. Not on your life. He came here as a visitor ten years ago, and he's still with us. Oh, so you don't want my father around? No, and I don't want any other visitors either. Oh! I am not going to stand here and let you talk to my daughter that way. No, what are you going to do about Edgar? it? Edgar! I'm going to take her away from here. Yeah? Where are you going to take her? Downstairs. Give him a piece of my mind. A Vivian! 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 No, 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 be calm. I'm sorry I was angry, but I didn't understand. You can have Joe and Ellie here. You can have anything you want. Look, you can, there, you can have that. Well, the only reason I wanted Joe and Ella was on account of the baby. Oh, I know, but why didn't you tell me? Well, I tried to, but you wouldn't listen. Oh, but from now on, I'll listen. Now, you sit down and take it nice and easy. I'm going down to the corner and get some cigars. <sighs> Here, buy yourself a new necktie, Grandpa. Ed must be crazy about Joe's baby. He must be crazy, all right. Well, before he comes back and changes his mind, we're going out to Brentwood and get Joe and Ella. Kids have noticed it.
in town and heard my wife was here. Has it happened yet? Not yet, Mr. Kennedy. Can I see her? Not until 24 hours afterward. Those are the doctor's orders. Oh. Well, uh, will you tell her I was here? I'll be waiting at home. I'll tell her right away. <laughs> oh, boy. It might be a girl. I saw the ambulance leave my house, and I... Well, if you just wait down here, I'll find... Well, I hurried here as quick as I could. Right in here, Mr. Kennedy. <laughs> Thank you. Nothing's happened yet, gentlemen. Just relax. Won't you be seated, Mr. Kennedy? Yeah. years. Yes. So nothing's happened yet? <laughs> See those notches? <laughs> Mr. Dinwoody? Here, here. A seven-pound boy. No, that's a seven... seven. Look. Uh, well, just a softy. Well, what am I going to do now? Here, try this. Oh, 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 <laughs> uh, Kennedy. Mr. Kennedy? Yeah, yeah, I'm Kennedy. Oh, uh, seven and a half pound boy. <laughs> oh, where are you going? Well, going up to see my wife. Just a minute. One reason my patients are all healthy is because they allow no one to see the baby or mother for 24 hours. Oh, but listen, I can't stay around here for 24 hours. Well, maybe you can make yourself busy at home getting the nursery ready. A nursery? Yes, you have a nursery for the baby, haven't you? Uh, oh, yes, yes, I got a nursery, sure. I, sure, a nursery. <laughs> uh, let's see. Four dollars a piece for the beds and the mattresses. Four dollars for the bed? Uh, Two dollars for the dresser. Two bucks for the... Uh, Eleven dollars for the other pieces of furniture yeah. and the two rugs. Mm. All right, whatever you say. That will leave a difference of a hundred dollars you owe me for the nursery equipment. Uh, well, <laughs> there's nothing too good for my baby. Bring it in. Jake, Tim. It's all right, boys. Take it away. You remember now, I want only the best. Price is no object. There it is, Mr. Kennedy. That is, if you want the best. Well, I hope you heard me say that the best is none too good. You bet we did. <laughs> How soon can you start? Oh. 
That is service. All right, boys, face the wall. I'm letting you down easy, Kennedy. $25 a window. $25 a window? Oh, I'll give you an allowance on your old rates. Well, that's different. Let's see. 85 cents for the pair. 85 cents? Hey, come in! Oh. Come on, Baldy. Quit playing. Well, you've got work to do. Mm. Ooh. All aboard. Ooh. Oh. Ooh. 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 Say, Viv. Yes? Are you sure this is all right with Ed? I told you he told me to go and get you. Yeah, yeah and he gave me a dollar. He did? That doesn't sound like Ed to me. No. You'd better not unpack until you find out. That's oh, right. No. There won't be any trouble. You may take the baby upstairs to the bedroom. Pop will show you the way. Yes. Be careful now, be careful. Yeah. Ooh, 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 ooh. Ooh. Right in here. Oh, oh, that baby. Oh, baby. Oh, my baby. Give me, give me the baby. Oh, honey, I know. How much does he weigh? Fourteen pounds. Fourteen pounds? Mm -hmm. Oh, and look at the hair. Oh, <laughs> my, oh, my, oh, my. I'll go down and get his bottle. All right. Mm -hmm. Oh, rock a bye, baby, on that treetop. When the wind blows, the cradle will rock. I oh, am. Yeah. How come all this? Well, the baby's got to have a nursery, hasn't it? Uh, yeah. Hey, Joe! Ella! Come here and see what Ella's done! Yeah, yeah, yeah! Want something to play with you? Want to watch? Wait a while. Wait a while. Come on. Yeah, sit it. Now, you want to sit up? Well, come on. Sit up. Sit up. Come on. Up you go. Hey, sit. Come on. All the way up. I'll put the pillow in you. Yeah. Oh, well. Say, he does it for the baby. How do you like it, Joe? Oh, it's swell. But you shouldn't have gone to all this expense. Oh, I'd say there's nothing too good for this baby. Oh, well, I'm glad you feel that way about it. Yeah. When Vivian came for Joe and me and the baby, Joe was afraid to come here. When Vivian came for you? Yeah, I thought my baby was still sore at me. But I told him after you saw our baby, you wouldn't be mad. Your baby? Yes, isn't it cute? Yeah. Where's Vivian now? Uh, she's downstairs putting the things away. <laughs> then you mean that she didn't Say, go Ella, to the... Say, Ella, has got some cute things for the baby. They were in the dresser. You mean those... those things on the dresser for... for Joe's baby? Yeah, what'd you do with them? They're back there. <clears throat> oh, these are darling. Mm -hmm. Darling, did you see the... Why, Edgar, oh, this is lovely. Oh, you think it was your baby. I did. I told him he shouldn't have done it. Oh, you don't know my Edgar. Well, that's very kind of him, but where's everybody going to sleep? Well, Ella and I can use the spare room. You can sleep with Papa. Well, I guess Edgar will have to sleep on the couch in the living room. I know he won't mind as long as it's for the baby. 